So dude, it's your boy just Jumper J back in again with the gameplay of GDA. Uh as you guys may or may not know right now, just came back from America and look here. This is the Los Santos from GDA which is pretty much based off uh Los Angeles which I went to. And yeah, if you watch the, the one of the vlogs I vlogged in Santa Monica Pier, this is pretty much the the exact same equivalent to the same um the, the whole thing. So yeah, I don't know if you just guys like look back on my vlogs and yeah, you probably see this place. But yeah, I think it's just pretty cool on how GDA Grand Theft Auto just made like a whole remake of Los Angeles in their own video game. So anyways, yeah, let's get right into the questions I guess. Uh yeah. Um Jacob Flatley asks if uh where where oh no, he asked what was my favorite part in the US in America. So probably Honestly, it'd probably be Bakersfield because the place is like so pretty and stuff, and like the houses are so convenient. And I don't know, man. And also, yeah, and also got probably the best part is that I got to play um, uh, Call of Duty in um one of the my f friend's house, I guess. And uh, yeah, uh, he also asks what I'm most keen for for the Olympics. So obviously, probably I think most people are probably gonna be keen for this, but it's probably the uh, the 100 meters, I just want to see like if Usain Bolt still has it in him to win another 100 meter gold medals in Rio, I believe. But I'm not into Olympics as much as I like. I'm sure most of you guys weren't as much as like it was as much into Olympics that you were before. Just I don't know, cause I think the reason why I was like always into Olympics before was probably because of Mario Sonic at the Olympic Games. And most of you guys probably know that because you guys probably play it too, but yeah, that answers your question. And also, whether if I'm gonna get the next Call of Duty, which is Infinite Warfare. So, obviously, probably yes, I think. Uh, I, from now on, I'm probably gonna get every single Call of Duty that they release uh, on like every year. So, I'll probably get Infinite Warfare no matter how bad it is. It's Call of Duty in, at the end of the day. So yeah, um, I'm pretty sure most of you guys also pre-ordered it just for the remastered version of COD 4, I believe, and yeah. But that that seemed cool too, but I've never played any old COD besides, like, below below Advanced Warfare, I was never good at Call of Duty. So yeah, only this game and Advanced Warfare, I mean Black Ops 3 and Advanced Warfare, not this game. But yeah, uh, yeah, but I started playing Android 3, so... Yeah, uh, if that, if you guys even care about that. But anyways, on to the next question. Ira asks, uh, where you want to go next on your holiday? To be honest, I really wanted to go back to America. It was probably the most fun place to be to. But unfortunately, I probably like go there on around this time in July again, because that's when evolution is on, and but that's when it's so sticky, hot, and humid. But yeah, besides evolution, I probably like want to go to maybe. Maybe not South America, probably back to probably Thailand. Like it's probably one of the best places to visit and I've been to Thailand before but I really love that place and my relatives are there as well. Go get nice to see nice to see relatives overseas. No matter where you go, but yeah. That's the question I guess. Jamie asks, what's your favorite clothing brand? So, uh my favorite clothing brand, I don't know man. I'm not like Recently, I've been into clothes a lot. Like after America, I've pretty much got inspired. But it's really hard to pick what like clothing brand like I, I like the best. But my brand in general would be Nike. But I wouldn't consider that as a clothing brand. I really like I consider like more sports or all around brand. But there's been not really that much clothes. But for clothing like like streetwear, skating, or like polos, like Nordicon and stuff. I have no idea, man. But it's probably gonna be like. For like skating and stuff and like streetwear, probably like I don't know, I can't decide on one thing because I I don't have all of them, but, but I have like a bunch of them. But probably Supreme, my favorite one actually. Like the I don't know because, but if you wear Supreme, you're like pretty much like the definition of a high beast. So yeah, uh, but I don't know man. Like Supreme half, uh, Odd Future. I really like that. I don't know why the donut and stuff. But yeah, to be honest, like mostly, like everything you wear is pretty much like your hype beast, which is pretty much what you're doing and what everyone's doing. But 
yeah, sometimes you just gotta accept the fact that we're high paced and yeah. But uh, yeah, uh, favorite clothing band, if I had to say, probably be like, Ecstasy or Huff and Supreme and all that, so yeah. Nike or Adidas, uh, I'll pick uh, Nike over Adidas. And uh, yeah, like, like, I don't know why I just said that randomly, but that was a question being asked from Esther. And I don't know what I'm saying right now, but anyways, next question. Uh, Gabrielle answers, uh, what, what do you want to be when you grow up? I've answered this a lot. Uh, really have no idea if I, like, I'm not, I don't plan to be one, but I want to be a doctor. Actually, stop this. From now on, I want, I want to become a freaking pimple popper. Like, Doc's pimple popper. And, yeah, do do the stuff that she does. Because they don't gross me up. They're actually really satisfying. And recently, like, I saw... Oh, nothing. Anyway, I'm not going to tell you guys. You, half of you guys are going to be like, vomit. But anyways, uh, next question. Australia, America. Uh, <laughs> just for the fact that I was just from America, I'll probably say America, but... Like, if I, if I were to move to America, I'd probably not. But I don't know if they're friendly out there. Even if, even the people in Bakersfield, if, even if I was living there, I don't know, man. Probably not. But, uh, yeah, I'm too used to Australia, I guess. But, you know, I, I sort of can't live anywhere else but Sydney, Australia. <clears throat> but, yeah, um, but as for, like, the food and the, like, the, the environment, not really the environment actually. I'm sure it's better overall to be honest, but it's just that I got to experience something more new in America, which is what makes it better than America. That what's ma what makes it seems better than Australia, but yeah, but to be honest, Australia is better. Like nothing could beat Australia, specifically Sydney as well. Like Sydney is probably the best uh, state in Australia. That's why all the houses are expensive because it's limited, you know, like. The people that want to come to Australia, like artists like Sydney, you have to you have to earn it, bro. Like you can't just copy like like Sydney's not like a Perth state where like if you go there you can go there like you can not have that much of a living and still live in Perth. But Sydney, you gotta earn for it, man. Like that's how good Sydney is. And like even like even like other cheap houses like Melbourne, like like they're not they those kind of states aren't the best states. But if you're in a visit. Like, if you're overseas, come to Sydney because it's probably the best one to understand. Yeah, there's a reason why everything's expensive here. And, um, yeah, and, uh, yeah, like, Melbourne and all those other states, Perth, Darwin, like, Tasmania even, I don't know, like, like, they're, they're cheap for a reason, so, yeah. Okay, I just rested, like, every state. But, <laughs> yeah, um, come at me, uh. We have the best architects as well. Anyways, um, thank you. Uh, I don't know any more questions left, but those kind of questions are pretty dodgy. But uh, did I have Chipotle? Yes, I did have Chipotle, but it's pretty much the equivalent to Mad Max, I guess. And yeah, uh, never asks uh, if I'll miss her. No, because I just saw you today, so no. And uh, yeah, uh, that answer was sort of. I mean, that question was sort of late. I mean, early. I don't even know what I'm saying. Anyways, uh. So, anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for this video. Hope you, hopefully, you guys like this gameplay. As you guys see right now, I'm just being chased by the police, and I have no idea what they come doing. And uh, yeah, look what I'm wearing as well. I'm just wearing, <laughs> I'm wearing underwears with uh, a pink, a pink singlet. That's nice. What am I doing? All right. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you guys are watching the gameplay right now, but it's pretty hilarious. Getting shot by the police anyway, but uh, yeah, anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for this video. Please take care of yourselves, like the video, and uh, don't do drugs, don't drink alcohol, and don't do that stuff because it's bad for you kids. So, yeah, yeah, anyways, bye. Yeah, I'm, I'm just watching the gameplay, just watch it together, guys. So, as you guys can see, I'm running, I'm swimming away from the police, but they still know where I am, which is which sucks. So, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do next. What, what am I going to do? Oh, it's, it's about to be morning anytime soon. Oh, I pulled out a grenade launcher. What happens? Oh, okay. Anyways, thank you, bye.